Hey guys, so I want to do a quick tutorial on how to make a basic um, virtual Bitmoji classroom in Google Slides. So the first thing that you are going to do is once you have your um, slides open, you're going to highlight these boxes and delete them. Then you're going to go to insert image and search the web. The first thing that we want to do is we want to find a um, background. So we're going to search floor and wall background. And however you want your um, classroom to look, you can pick your background based off of that. I just want a very basic one. Then you'll size it. Okay, then I will go back over here since my um, insert and search the web tab is still open. I will go back over here and I want to add a bookshelf. So I'm going to type in transparent bookshelf and typing in the word transparent uh, typing in the word transparent helps take away that white background that would be in the picture then we're going to drag and insert it resize it Then I want to add some books to my bookshelf. So I would go up to Google search, um, type in, say I want to do a Dr. Seuss book. Then click images. I, there's a wocket in my pocket, so I'm going to right click over that, copy the image, Go back to my slide, right click, click paste. Then I would just resize my book for it to fit on my shelf. Okay. Then say I want to add a sofa or a couch drag it over resize it but I don't like the color or I don't you know like the color of that couch or think it goes with my picture so what I would do is right click go to format options recolor and go down till I find the perfect color let's do gray that's perfect and then just you know resize it as needed I want to add a rug. Resize it. For it to fit perfectly. And if you don't like the color on that, you can do the follow the same instructions to change that. Okay, let's do, um, what if I, say if I want to just add a whiteboard, I will go up to shapes, insert my shape here, and you can just size it, then 
then you have your board up there. You can insert text box. Miss Simpson's class and just add it to the board. Size it however you want to. Change the font if you would like. And then you would just repeat those steps to add anything else or other things that you may want to add um, to your classroom. I hope this helps you get started. Thanks.